Act Five, The Forest. A few minutes before. I hope this river leads me to the end of this place. This place feels familiar and safe. I think this is where I need to be. This is where I would go camping with my dad, together by the fire, looking up at the stars. Mom wouldn't stop buying me books. She wanted me to stay home, close to her, escape into other worlds, not to go into woods. He always wanted to know everything about my classmates, what secrets they told me. I am here, at the center of the small universe, and I understand. Even my backpack is here, with all my stuff in it. Memories of our camping trips. There were some good times, but I need to travel alone now. I can't remember the last time I ate. Can't remember what food tastes like. Nothing. The familiar imprint of him lingers, but is gone. Is this what he left me? My own little treehouse? I've never seen something like this, only read about it in fairy tales. My telescope. It feels so fragile and old. All the books Mom gave me are here, waiting for me. Like they knew I would return one day. This place feels like home now, surrounded by my mess. Looks like just like mine. Only older. Or have I been wandering for years in this place already? Not correct, not Virgo and La Leo anymore. Hmm. Looked, but I know I know I need to go there. That's my room. Or am I in my room now? Am I looking at something that doesn't exist anymore? This looks like an older guy. Okay, okay. Mm. Nope. Will be one of the bigger one. Aquarius. The constellations, my eternal companions, at least they are the same. And this one. Um, Sagittarius.
this key looks ancient. All this time, I just wanted to disappear into this bed. Now I'm home and ready to close my eyes. And this concludes the Almost Gone. Thank you very much. Stay alive and see you soon. Bye.